bunch. <gasps> if you have a problem, pull this handle. It signals us and we arrive in the blink of an eye. Move, Bob. It's gonna be really difficult for them to find us down here. Hmm. Everyone! Anyone! Miguel? Well, it's not fair that you use the signal to find us. Miguel, you have big problem. Mr. Maurice weird. Mr. Maurice no longer recognized Miguel. Hello, my friends. Who are you? But Maurice, it's us. What is this all about? Oh, and who is he? He looks fierce. You think he bites? That's Junior. That's your son. Really? I have a son? But that's great news. Nice to meet you, son. I'm a... Uh, who am I? Well, then I think Mr. Maurice's brain is poo. Yes. It's like all of his memory has suddenly gone. Hmm. Junior, did your father get hit hard in the head? <laughs> memory loss without a hit. Hmm. Let's see. It could be... Hmm. TAS, Tiger Amnesia Syndrome, NDME, Nasal Dehydration Massive Expulsion, or TMCC. <gasps> TMCC? But it sounds terrible. Gilbert, what is it? Too much cockroach clavuti. Hmm. Hmm. One way to find out. Hmm. Verification! But sir, we don't walk all over people like that without invitations. Hmm. I knew it! This is the mark of arachnidia amnesia the most dangerous spider in the jungle. When she bites you, you instantly lose all of your memory. We must move fast, because three hours after the bite, the effects are final. But in three hours, it'll be dark. What do we do, Gilbert? There is an antidote. It is a jelly that protects arachnidia amnesia eggs, and it can only be found in the cave where they live. Where is this cave? I have no idea where the cave is, but I may have a way to find it. When we go find Mr. Maurice, Mr. Maurice here. We have to search everywhere. We have to catch the spider if we want to find the cave. <laughs> this game looks fun. Can someone explain the rules? Only one rule for you. Do not move and stay right where you are. Uh, I think we found her. But come quickly. She doesn't seem very nice. We must catch her, but be careful. It's important not to touch her. Oh, yeah? Who's that? But why should we not say hello? That's very rude. She's very nice. I like spiders. Well done, Junior! <laughs> Arachnidia amnesia are special spiders. They live in colonies, and when they feel they're in danger, watch what they do. They always point to the den. All right, let's get going, my friends! Why do you always look at me like that with your sad eyes? A great warrior tiger? Really? Where? I am? <laughs> Children, they have such imaginations. Excuse me, my friends. Is it all right for his father to hold him for a while? Because I've been carrying him and... Uh... But you are his father, Maurice. <laughs> oh, right. Well, that was quite a hike. Look, we can't slow down. Sunset will be in an hour. We have to keep moving. Fine, I'll leave it to you. Otherwise, I'll be late for dinner. Uh, where do I live, anyway? Uh, you live close to here, mm -hmm. just down the path. 
I live here? Wow, classy. Well, from now on, be very careful. These spiders are extremely dangerous. And besides, they don't like intruders. Remind me to add some color. It looks sad in here. They are workers. They are focused on their work. If we do not make any noise, they will not notice us at all. Is my home mm -hmm. still far? I'm getting hungry. <laughs> Huh? Danger? Are you sure? Marie, run! The soup's getting cold! Ah, that is dangerous! I'm coming, my friend! <laughs> hey, hey, buddy! You wanna eat? Come on, my pleasure! <laughs> Phew! No one's been bitten. That certainly was a little too close for comfort. Uh, what is a spider? Uh, it seems that I'm Maurice, and you? Uh, me not know what you two call me. Uh, Miguel, your name is Miguel! Miguel, your name is Miguel. Not know what Miguel, your name is Miguel doing here. Well, don't worry. Miguel, your name is Miguel. You're going to a party at the bottom of the cave, and it's supposed to be great. Hey, party, party, party. Oh, there's a party at my house? Well, I was not aware. Was I invited? Look, Gilbert, we have to find the antidote. Those two have a screw loose. It'll get complicated soon. Well, now we have to be on our guard. The more we approach the eggs, the more likely the spiders will be aggressive. Hey, hey, I think this is the party. Look there, the decorations just lit up. Oh, no, there are the eyes! Eyes of warrior spiders! Ah, we must get out of here! <laughs> Why leave so soon? We've got lots of cute guests. Uh, Miguel, your name is Miguel? Can you thump a little bit? Dumpy? Dumpy? Uh, dumpy. Hello, my friend. What can I do for you? <coughs> huh? <laughs> Girl, your name is Miguel. To dump again. No, it's good. And me? Is it someone to help me? Don't be, don't be, don't be. Oh, thank you. I thought I'd never get out of this mess. How you doing, Patricia? Hmm? Ah! Why are you talking so loud? Who are you? Oh, no, I can't believe it. She's been bitten, too. I'm Miguel. Your name is Miguel. And I've been told that my name's Maurice. Hello. Ah, we'll introduce ourselves later. Come on. There's a special party awaiting us. Oh, a party. Great. I love parties. Are you invited too? Of course I am. Well, too bad, but I'll go anyway. Hmm. Ah. And that's the cave with the eggs. All we need is a little jelly to cure them and this nightmare will be over. Oh, no! There's a guard! And a really big one at that! Hey, is that the dance floor? Hello, miss. Care to dance? Oh, it's a costume party. You should have said I would have made an effort. <laughs> oh. <laughs> That's great. A surprise party in my own home. Can't wait to see more. <laughs> you know. Mm. Ah, what are we doing up here on this wall? It's a long story. I'll tell you after. Uh, Miguel, your name is... Miguel, can you free us now? Uh -huh. 
Junior, what are you doing so far from my arm? Come to your daddy. Uh, I'm not sure why you say this, but I also have the feeling I missed you. Congratulations, son. I'm really proud of you. If you had not been able to sprinkle us with jelly, I would have definitely lost my memory. I'd have even forgot that I'm a tiger. <laughs> Can you believe that? Wait, didn't we agree that the first one found in hide-and-seek would have to forfeit? Oh, that's right. You lost, Maurice. You deserve a forfeit. You'll do the dishes for Alan Bob for a week. Oh, yes. Huh? Ah! Uh, hello, my friends. Who are you? Huh? Oh, no. It's not possible again. Tiger Warrior's new technique to avoid forfeits. <laughs> I crossed various plants, a concoction of Baomium vulgaris with an extract of Arbora gluantic to finally arrive to this extremely sticky resin. Mm. Allow me to demonstrate. Only two drops needed. Uh. This is unbelievable. It's as if it's become part of the rock. <laughs> What's the big deal? It's just glue. Yes, he's right. Yeah, that's it. Is. It's, it's just clear. Clear. Gonna Okay, fine, Mr. I invented everything. Let's see if you can do any better. It's not my fault that glue has already been invented. Let's continue with the Jungle Genius Awards. Up next, we have Gilbert and Ernest to present their latest invention. Mm. Well, together, Ernest and I have invented a new source of energy. It was my idea. Well... Anyway, thanks to this incredible box, we can compress gas. But not just any gas, the fumes of Pippo's flatulence that we capture and store in this coconut. Yes, and we named it the Toot Box, huh? Uh, no, we agreed that we're calling it a natural gas compressor. Hmm? Ugh, a disgusting Toot Box. Now, the compressor is filled. It's time for a demonstration. <laughs> Strong. <laughs> so sorry. Please note the result achieved with just two turns of the handle. Imagine the level of energy we produce with a hundred. Vladimir, you again? <laughs> I know how to use this special source of energy. Or even. <laughs> with this amazing weapon of destruction, I'll get lots of slaves to build me a palace as grandiose as I am! <laughs> and open. Gilbert, Ernest, you're not at the awards ceremony? No, the ceremony was interrupted by Vladimir, who stole our invention. And now he's got a devastating energy source of his own. Yes, the toot bugs can be very dangerous. <laughs> toot bugs! <laughs> There's no time to lose. We have to find this thief, Vladimir. He's going to need toot reserves to charge the machine. Ernest is right. We must go to the hippos immediately. They're the source of the gas. <laughs> if you don't hurry up, the great Vladimir will destroy everything. Oh, yeah? That's easy for you to say. <laughs> what makes you think I can just toot on command? What? Oh. Nobody has the right to mock Vladimir the Magnificent's orders. Do they, Igor? No one, Master. Oh, really? Not even the Jungle Bunch? Bye-bye, <laughs> Jungle Bunch! Uh, uh, Vladimir took off. I'll try and spot him. Here is the perfect spot to build the palace for Vladimir the Grand. Over there, I can see the Imperial Showers. And that will be my massive banquet hall. You, what are you doing here? You're in Vladimir the Grand's master bedroom. Now shoo, go wait in the hall. The hall's over there. Voila, there you are in the hall. Come on, now get back to work, slaves. Okay, we need to distract him and Patricia will steal his tune. I mean, his natural gas machine. Mm -hmm. Come on, slaves. Vladimir the Great wants his palace right now. Great Vladimir is as tall as a pickle. 
Who dares to mock me, the great Vladimir? <laughs> Vladimir's as ugly as a war. But, but no, that's not true. I'm handsome. Vladimir, the one who stinks and toots. He plays the trumpet with his nose. <laughs> no, that's not true either. I smell very good. My nose, my nose is perfect. Your greatness, you're under attack. Huh? Look up. Come out now, or I will turn your friend into crocodile pudding. <gasps> okay, Vladimir, we surrender. But you'd better not lay a hand on Patricia, or else... Mm. Here you are at my mercy, Jungle Bunch. And you will all join in and help my slaves build my palace. What a sinister creature. If only we could get that box from him. Why don't we just block the hole on the cute box? That would be the logical solution. Uh, wait, that's a brilliant idea. Leave it to me. So, Vladimir, when did you say you wanted your little palace finished? What? This is no little palace. This is my grand palace. How dare you insult Vladimir? No, 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 not at all. I just think that it's really small, isn't it? Would you please stop with that horrible word? But you know, in my laboratory, I've got all the tools necessary to build a palace that's, how can I say, Vladimir-esque? Mm-hmm. I've got it! Gilbert, go get your tools in your laboratory to build a palace that is Vladimir-esque! At your command, Vladimir! I'll give you one hour. Otherwise, your friends go squeak, boom, pop! Is that clear? <laughs> I have to convince Marla to give me her resin. Hmm. I'll have to handle it delicately in order to succeed. <laughs> Marla, mm -hmm. give me your resin! Mm -hmm. <laughs> Gilbert, so now you want mm -hmm. my resin. I thought you told everyone it was just glue. No, 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 I never said that. Come on, give it to me. I need it to save the jungle. To save the jungle, indeed. And why exactly should I believe you? Hmm. Isn't this Salfarita Truthium? If I eat it, I'll be forced to tell the truth, right? Hmm. Mm. Oh. Oh. I need your resin to save the jungle, okay? Do you believe me now? Well... And your hat looks like elephant dung. Oops. Huh? Okay, that's enough. Here, take the resin. But to be very clear, the reason I give you the resin isn't because of your body or beautiful eyes. It's to save the jungle. Which is in grave danger. Thank you, Marla. And stop looking at my hat! <laughs> Hurry up, you lazy lumps! Vladimir the Great must sleep in this palace at once! Of course, great Vladimir. Your wish is our command. Psst, it's me, Gilbert. Listen, I found a way to block the box. When you hear my signal, run over and grab it from him. It's clogged, it's clogged, it's clogged! That's the signal, Miguel. Attack! What's this? A betrayal? What? A rebellion? Mobrats, out! Mobrats, no! You ugly Mobrats! Ah, water! Water in my eyes! Quit it, it's just water! Oh, yeah, that's true. It's okay now, you're free, my friends. Uh, thank, thank you, Chuckle Bunch. Bunch. Thank, thank you. you! Hey, you creep! You're gonna wish you never messed with the Jungle Bunch. Igor! I'm coming, Master. Here I am. I'm coming! I'm here, Master. Ah! Ah! What? Ah. Not what I expected. Miguel, pop big bubble. No, Miguel, don't do it yet. If it explodes, we'll all be in danger. That bubble will wipe out the whole jungle. We'll need to get the box somewhere deserted. I'm on it. No, Patricia, I do rescue! But you're just falling! <laughs> Bad possum, not move. That's not what I had in mind, Patricia. Okay, now let's go to plan B. Are all systems go, Gilbert? Yes, 100%. All right, light them up, Miguel. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Ernest, Vladimir's escaping. He just jumped in a hole. <laughs> it's a secret passage. I built it myself. A palace without a secret passage isn't a real palace. Pretty smart, huh? <sighs> Got it, Maurice! <laughs> 
Off to the ocean we go! Marine, we have to get away fast! It will into bits. They shattered all of my beautiful dreams, and I'm stuck inside this hole. <laughs> and now the moment you've all been waiting for. This year's Jungle Genius Award Grand Prize goes to... <laughs> Gilbert and Ernest for their new energy source that's 100% organic. <laughs> Ah, uh, in all fairness, Ernest and I can't accept this prize. Our invention turned out to be dangerous and bad hands. The one who deserves it is Marla. Her resin saved the jungle from destruction. Oh, a plot twist. Fantastic. The grand prize now goes to... Marla! <gasps> bravo, Marla! Bravo, bravo! 